It is Friday, bros and ghouls. Today I'm going to show you how to create Crazy Steve's Decay look from TNA Wrestling. I already did his older paint, but I had so many requests for this version. For a list of products using this tutorial, check out the video description below. Shout out to these peeps for requesting this video. Start by sketching out the skull outline in white using a medium pointed brush. The border should run along the temple, around the cheekbones, and inward just outside the top lip. Aim to keep the design symmetrical and reference photos of Crazy Steve if needed. Next outline the lower eye socket in white. Continue the skull design up along the hairline and begin filling the forehead in with white as well. Continue outlining the eye sockets, leaving the inner skin exposed. Now fill in the nose and cheek area, and between the eyebrows with white. Complete the skull by outlining the brows, and complete each socket shape. Then, using black, apply a hard outline along the perimeter of the skull design. I applied Maron Paradise Black using a large angle brush. Sweep the black towards your hair, filling in any exposed areas of skin. Continue along the temple, repeating the same process. Fill in the chin with black, leaving the bottom lip exposed so you can breathe and talk without smearing any makeup. Continue filling in all the blank areas of skin with black. This includes the ears, neck, and some of the hair. Follow the outline of the opposite side of the face and repeat the same process. Well, now that your black makeup palette is empty, <laughs> time to add your own personal touch to this look. Use a small flat or pointed brush. Begin adding dashes of red across the forehead. Keep the dashes spaced out so the look doesn't become too muddy. Add hints of black to your red makeup to create some variety. You want to shoot for a mix of red and maroon. Continue adding dashes and smudges of red along the skull outline and to the nose. Cry some tears of evil by applying black along the eye socket, tapering down the face to a jagged point. Fill in the eye socket and sweep dashes of black outside of the oval shape. Think Heath Ledger's Joker or artistically smeared mascara. Just have fun with it. Add another rough vertical line along the temple. Add a few more black dabs and dashes horizontally along the middle of the forehead and bridge of the nose, repeating the same process for the other eye. Fill in the remaining skin above the upper eyelid in white, keeping this element clean for better contrast. Finish up the bottom lip by filling in with black. If you're feeling crazy, feel free to subscribe, rate, or request a look you want to see.